Hello, I am Bentham and welcome back to Factorio Mass with Arumba, Avak, Shen and Stijo. Say hello everyone. Hello everyone. Hey, I'm how are you doing? Does what? anyone remember where we left off? Not a clue. God modules everywhere. It's been a week oh. since we've played. Uh, uh, I do seem to recall something about God modules and gems. That's all I yeah, remember. Gems. What about gems? <laughs> we've got most of the gem production fully upgraded. We I have got oh, yeah. very Tanks. high pro, very very high uh, priority to get the gem production going with that. Make us yeah, only a thousand diamonds. That. It's beautiful. Oh. We had just gotten god modules. Like you guys don't even have too many of them yet, do you? Nope. I've used about twenty. Well, throw them wherever you can. Our pollution will start going down. That'll be nice. Yep. Wait, why would you care about pollution? I don't know. Uh, just because it saves ammo, basically. I mean, you spend fewer iron and copper. Oh my god, these these boxes. Bentham, what have you done with these boxes? They're full. What, the storage crates? Oh wow, that's a lot. Uh, I'm popping storage around nothing to do with me. recharging points around a couple of the uh, robo antennas, I guess they are. Oh god, the oh, jug is real. Laser turret mark yeah. two is I like. I've been playing a lot of this with uh, some of my friends from the UK, and it's like no issue at all. Nice. And it's a momentary spike. It'll stabilize. <laughs> I, I don't think That's so. That's that guy. Bentham, we don't trust you. Friends. My experience has has taught me otherwise, Bentham. We've had this before. It's been a bit choppy at the start, and then it's calmed down. And then you disconnected, um, and it was great. Yay! <laughs> I fixed it okay, oh, and then moved to a different connection, thus making the fix pointless, but the the new connection is also good. That is mean. Steve, oh. why are you so mean? Cobalts. <laughs> I've been, so uh... what were we talking about? We were talking about doing some uh, lithium-ion batteries today, right? How, how, how hard are those to make? Uh, they use things that are weird and scarily named. <laughs> It's actually, uh, I did those Fantastic. just the other day on my stream in like five minutes. Lithium ion batteries are actually quite simple. Uh, so you need Fantastic. you need a pump, pump, and you pump lithium water. I have no idea what the hell that is, but it's got lithium in it apparently. And uh, then you run it through an electrolyzer, I think, and that gives you lithium, basically. Lithium chloride electrolysis, yep. Sounds fantastic. Make it so. Make you it so. You're going to make me do it, are you? Um, I'm going to start messing around with your upgrade setup, I remember. I'm basically focusing on getting myself some personal shields so I don't waste all of my construction <laughs> robots <laughs> That's again. That's right, you died last time. Uh -huh. that was so bad. That was so, so bad. It happens Have to you? everyone. CJ, you do whatever you'd like with this setup. I, I got a lot of complaints over the last week about me just tinkering with the logistics, like settings and stuff, for the entire week. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is basically all I did. I was like, God modules, God modules, must have God modules. Pretty much, yes. And, I'll show uh, you what I've got in my single player campaign uh, for this upgrade setup. I like it. It's a, it's a smart thing to do. Okay. Yep, you hear that, Arimba? I like something you've done. It's oh, yeah? Me, no, yep. I don't believe it. I want to see what you're, what you're looking at. <laughs> I don't to... believe it. You know, do we three... have lithium somewhere? Lithium is uh, something we just talked about. It's made from lithium water. <laughs> yeah, but do we have it? That's what I'm. I... No, no, we don't have it. Only, yet. You don't really I'll... need it for anything else. Okay. Yeah, it's just for lithium batteries, I think. I've got a lot of instruction oh, robots just following me around right now. Yeah. Yeah, Probably but I mean, they're them. actually. Oh, they're charging, right? Okay. I was going to say, I don't understand because they're not returning. Well, they they're just your, stood they around. They charge on your backpack. Yeah. Oh, that's fantastic. Is there nothing here? We don't have any electronic components, so that's not good. Every time something runs out, it's like, find the problem. Where did yeah. this come from? Uh, that's, mm. my <laughs> that's pretty much what this game is about. All right, just what's have missing? No construction robots. What the hell? We have no tinned copper wire. Why don't we have tinned copper wire? <laughs> Who's doing something ridiculous with the construction robots? Uh, it wasn't me. I'm not sure if you can hear my grin right now. <laughs> uh, it's probably Avak, based on everything 
I know about him as a person. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I have deduced. We have no Bro. tin copper wire because we have no tin. All right. Oh, why don't we have tin? Um, where does the tin, tin even come from here? Yeah. One of the assembly lines was doing tin. Ah, right. The tin will become down here. I see. Oh, okay. Well, it was, I think I was doing this. Just forgot all about it. All right. No worries. <laughs> so wait, you're saying it's your, it was your fault? That yeah, what I heard? It, was, it was probably at the end of last week. I am fairly sure. Yeah. So that's what he said. I think, yeah, I think I did that. Oh God. So lithium percolate. What the hell do we do with lithium percolate again? Oh, you're doing no the lithium idea. thing. Cause I was doing the lithium thing. I'm doing the lithium thing. Uh, you can do the lithium thing too. We might actually get it done this week then. Maybe. Unlikely. Oh, okay. Maybe not then. And there's less though. You might be doing a different lithium thing than the lithium thing I'm doing. Because I was I doing lithium don't... chloride. I don't remember what you're supposed to do with lithium percolate. You do something with it. I think there's something else. I think you make the chloride. Might be in a furnace, possibly. You turn the chloride into lithium. You mix that with. Oh dear! Cobalt. Who 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 thought it was a grand idea to deconstruct a chest oh. randomly in the factory? Because so I walked within range of it, and all of a sudden, all of my robots were like, "Oh, look, this job for us to do. Let's go do it." <laughs> that sounds like me. Uh, you scallywag. And that is why personal RoboPorts suck. <laughs> that sounds like a more efficient way of dumping infinite amounts of salt into someone's inventory. It does, actually. Though there's a huge group of uh, construction robots here doing nothing. Hmm. They just sat there. Uh, just gonna... Are they trying to charge? No, I didn't. no, they're not trying to charge or anything. They literally just stood here. Oh, is there nowhere for them to go? Dead zone they might need more boxes. Well, I just... I'll pop down a charging station there. Because I've got um, a request for 10 of the charging stations at all times. So I can help with that just as I see it. But, uh, wow. That was a lot of robots to have just picked up. No, I was just trying to make this system way more complicated than it needs to be. It's literally, you just take lithium water into a furnace, into an electrolyzer, lithium plate. Oh, I think we're, well, we're essentially with, racing with, at this point because I'm still setting it up because I've got nothing else to do. But then I, I forget I forget completely what the lithium percolates for. It's for something. Is it for batteries? Ah, yes, that's right. Batteries yeah. use lithium percolate. Gotcha. And lithium cobalt per, oxide. Perchlorate, sorry. Perchlorate, yeah. Perchlorate. That's, not, that's not percolated lithium. Let's shove it so in your have, coffee machine. That sounds fantastic. <laughs> do it now. <laughs> We've got the carbon and the plastic bars. We just need the lithium cobalt oxide now. Oh, man, that's just so annoying. Aha. And uh, fortunately, because of Bentham, we do have the cobalt oxide already. Yeah, I so you have you're... useful. You haven't <laughs> used it all, have you? Have you been putting yeah. into the logistic network, maybe? Yeah, there's ridiculous amounts of it. Nice. Okay, so... It makes me very we'll sad by, by how quick Bentham is to try and reassure us all that he is, in fact, useful. Are you sorting out the tin, Shen? Yep. Oh, okay, I'll leave you to it then. Got it. Okay, there we go. Sorry about that. Oh my lord. Wait. So are you just going to request the cobalt? Yeah, I'll request it in. Um. I agree. I'm just going to change that to a green instead of. Yeah. Oh, for a less than? Robots, I'm very disappointed with how little progress you've made on this gigantic task I sent you. Is there an express version of the green starter? No, I wish there was though. That would be so good. Express that's one thing that Bob... There's, of... there's so many fucking inserters. And that's one thing that he fucked up and he missed. Was an express smart inserter. You sure? You sure there's no more? By the way, we're, we're getting no god module production at all right now. Something's wrong. It's gotta be because of the transistors. Or not the transistors, the... Um, what are they called? Oh, you know what it is? Is that effectivity boards... Okay, if you have god modules, please come down and throw them into the green level one effectivity module board production. Because they're oh, being used for science. Right. 
right right next to me right here. They're being used for science, and so they're all going into the science labs right next door instead of into God module production. Should have just which? God moduled the entire thing before yeah, to telling be honest, anyone that there was God Steve, modules. Steve <laughs> just did it. Apparently he's getting all of the God modules. <laughs> uh, I asked for 20, so I had like 13 well on done, it. Well done, Steve. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah, I asked for 100 and they got zero. Hey, mm -hmm. I remember, come, come check what I've done. I'm going to ask for 10 because I'm not greedy. You done a thing, okay. Yep. Come check what I done. I like it. Come check what okay, I done. What I got done. done? Oh, okay. Uh, right. so you've gotten rid of my extra chest. Got it. Yep. So what happens is if there isn't any assembly machine ones in this box, then it'll make one and pull it out and put it in the box. Mm -hmm. And then it does the exact same, but all of these are requesting the maximum that they can out of the the network. So if there's any to be upgraded, they'll be upgraded first before it creates any. Okay. And then it, it bops all the way down the all the way down the line up until the passive provider, which should be accepting, uh, okay. which should be making fifty, and just sitting okay. in the system. So Although your goal is to get rid of all of the older ones. You don't want to keep any of them on hand. No, just upgrade them all to reds. I wonder Makes if sense. there's ever ever a time where a, a Mark two, three, four, five, you know, might be better than a Mark six. I doubt it. You can put more God modules in the Mark sixes. Yeah, but you reach a point where even express sense. express inserters can't keep up. But at least you get the efficiency. <laughs> yeah, it's true. The effectivity bonus. Yeah, I like it. Cool. It needs more God modules. <laughs> <laughs> Everything also, needs more God modules. The only also, issue with it is it's a pain in the ass to set up a lot yeah, of the All those wires. And you can you um if you were to copy paste that as a blueprint and then change over the input filters on the smart smart inserters, could you just copy paste it and have it do wires too? I don't know if they would do wires. Those red wires. Phantom, Shen, what are you up to? I am trying to figure out why these stupid robots are not doing their job. I'm wandering around yeah, looking at that. stuff that's involved in my loop in some way. No, it doesn't do wires. I'm going to come check on what you're up to, Phantom. I was just over here looking at these. I'm, I might upgrade them, but the belt's already fairly full on one side. Then why don't you help it not be full on one side down here? Well, I, I could. I was considering it. <laughs> I think this may be a wise course of action, honestly. Uh, alternatively, we could uh, go and get some other materials. Are there other materials that we require at the moment? Does it get them um, by mining them from nearby or by going forth and murdering? We have tungsten. I'm I'm thinking along the lines of, of another another outpost. Because yep, the have... robots are making the base a bit boring. There, I said it. <laughs> <laughs> you you always think that though, don't you? Um the, the robots make the base boring? No, not generally. I mean sometimes if it gets excessive, but uh the I think the Bob's mod robots have compounded that problem. Do we not have any do we not have any solder on the uh circuit board solder. production line? It's completely empty. What resources do we okay. need at the moment? Okay, a uh, very small amount of uh, lithium ion batteries are happening now. I'm going to grab a train up to the gold outpost, check on that. You might want to put some gold modules in it so we can get some more gold out of it. Do we really need more gold? Well, there's no more gold for miles. Yeah, but we've already got 29,000 we'll units of gold. We just don't use it that fast. What if we did? We're obviously well, not using enough gold. Okay, I think we should increase gold use. Once gold use has been increased, we will increase gold production. Okay. I think Gold's, this makes sense. It's really only used for... Uh... Module contacts, I think. Isn't it? God Is there much else? Um, I'm really not there sure. are a couple of things, but yeah, module contacts is the main thing that you're going to use it for. Do we need more logistics robots? Yes. Well, Always. at this point, I mean, the main base is actually converting to a purely robotic logistics solution, so yeah, probably. It's just Almost weird that we don't have... Campaign. 
I've got 5,000 of each. And it's still we, don't have, load. we don't have any solder on the belts. So we're not making any circuit boards right now without the solder. Except there's, there's 2,700 of the, what are they called, solder plates just sitting here waiting to be picked up by robots and brought like 10 feet away. But that's, that's the, the problem. Is, is everyone's solution <laughs> right now is like, oh, I've, I've made a, a miner drill. It's mining coal. I'll just stick it into a, a supplier chest or whatever. Provider no. chest. And so all of a sudden, there's, there's robots <laughs> going to the other side of the map to pick it up. Oh, I didn't just robots. do that. No, I didn't do that. Crazy. But th that is the, the issue that we're struggling with right now, is that the robots are doing very menial tasks, and thus they're not available to do other, more important there's, menial tasks. There's nothing wrong There's nothing wrong with them doing menial tasks. It's no, just... not at all. We need, we need more of them. Yes. A lot more. And, uh, unfortunately, because the outpost actually has the most responsive robots now, because they're not doing a million other things, they're literally just servicing this outpost, all of my nickel has been dumped into the storage chests up here. <laughs> well done. So we've got a little stockpile of nickel up in the gold mining area. Hooray? Yeah, I, I, I think hooray. We could move there in case of emergency. Oh, we'd need we'd need to like set up some other storage. Perhaps we should set up a little uh, little outpost survival package. Just just the things to get by, enough to kickstart our economy. If worst thing came to worst and a huge biter wave attacked the main fort and crushed it, and we had to evacuate on the train, just fleeing, watching in the distance as the, our factory just turns into a large flaming inferno. One thing I was thinking was having. A like a little causeway in the going into the lake in the north, and then just okay. have an island in the middle of it that we build a fort on. I like this idea. It would require use of <laughs> landfill. Uh, oh, I don't like this idea anymore. I rescind my support. It's such wah, a cool wah, idea. Wah. Yeah, someone Indeed. shut that thing up. I want a sea island fort thing. Island fort thing. <laughs> We need to get some electric uh, furnaces, or rather not electric okay. furnaces, but the chemical furnaces, and use them to smelt everything instead of all of these steel, in, uh, steel furnaces that we've got. Okay, why? Well, we've got god modules now, and you can't put modules in a steel ah, furnace. Ah, yeah, good call. Good point. So, in order to increase the smelting capacity, all you need to do is shove modules in, as opposed to like, build another furnace array. Mm-hmm. Yeah, sounds like a good idea to me. Wah, wah, wah. I agree. Looking forward to uh, God Module 3s, remember? So. I have not done those yet, because oh they require God. tungsten. You wait. I thought you said you didn't do. You haven't done tungsten. I have done tungsten. Hmm. That's just a pain in the ass. Mm -hmm. well, I'm okay. looking forward to God Module Threes because they have they have gems in them. Yeah, that's the other thing is that in my solo campaign, I don't. <laughs> I, I never did the gem thing. Uh, I didn't have a resident Bentham. So. <laughs> resident See, you need me. That's fantastic. I do. You need me. You've just I've... validated Bentham's existence. Well done, Rumba. Yeah, uh, he's got his virtues. I'm glad he's here. I wouldn't go as far as to call him virtuous, but he is useful. Well, the good news is that the uh, God Mantra production should kick in soon. We've almost got... The, the science uh, little grid things are sucking up all of the effectivity module ones. Goodbye, I don't Shan. know why. Bye, bye. <laughs> uh, it's probably because I put on um, uh, efficiency except... modules 4 to be done, and then they've just used them all. Yeah, I, I restricted the efficiency module production down to just 10 instead of 50, because otherwise it, no god modules could be made while it's trying to build up the chain. Okay. We could do some more heavy oil. Oh wow, Bantam, so many god modules in the gems. We've got the god a ton of light oil and no heavy oil. So many, why? Why do we want these god modules? You want them in everything. In the gems? They should be in everything. All right, then. Well, I think if they're in gems, you could probably put them somewhere more useful. <laughs> yeah, you should make sure that they're in machines that are running. 
If they're just in a machine that's not actually on, then they're doing absolutely nothing. The gym yeah. machines are running all the time. Oh, well, good. There you go. But like, 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 no, you'll notice not that... Um, liar. They're backed up. They're just filling up j chests full of diamonds at the moment. Well, yes, but that's why they're running. <laughs> but you'll notice that if you have a machine that is, um, it has like a, a cost to it all the time. It's, uh, mm -hmm. what do you call it? The, uh, drain. The drain doesn't go down when you put in god modules. It stays the same. Oh, okay. So it's like a floor on energy consumption. I'm just going to steal all these effectivity boards from science and put them into the other thing. You get more god, god modules. Yeah. Have you god moduled up the effectivity boards? Or the efficiency boards? Yes. There's only one thing producing them. And I'm working on trying to get god modules into the tinned copper wire production now. Right. So we can make more. Right, well, what's the goal at the moment, then? Uh, well, right now, the robot went, but basically God module all the things, keep on going up the tech tree. Is there any particular goal? And Yeah, the, the robot has gone, but just for the, the... So we know where we're going in the next episode. What are we actually aiming for, if anything? Try to get everything what? working right now. Yeah, you everything. mean like endpoint? Endpoint for the campaign? I mean, I, I don't know. Maybe we should try to build the rocket defense. Not quite that far down, what? but um, no. like an immediate short-term goal beyond just making things more efficient. Rather, what are we making them more efficient for? Don't say because we want to make them more efficient. I was going to say so we can make, make, and make more, uh, more logistics robots. That's got to be our goal. Okay, Enough well, logistics robots that's cool, to then. completely run the factory on its own. That's what we'll aim for. We'll aim for all of the logistics robots. Infinite bots. And all Forever. of the god modules. Uh, those two. Okay. Uh, I, so I got distracted there. I put down a split it backwards. That's anyway. the way you said, okay, with, with you know, drive Bustle. and purpose and then stopped. <laughs> <It's> like, uh, <laughs> have we broken Bentham? I couldn't talk and build at the same time. I'm done now. Okay. We should say goodbye. Thank you for watching. And we shall see you next time. Have a good day. Take care, everyone. See you soon. We are lacking heavy oil, like seriously. Did we not fix that with god modules? I, I, where do you think all the modules went from the diamonds? Well, I didn't know they'd smart. gone. My goodness. Curse you. <laughs> <laughs> Curse you. I just wish you, you I, I have this mental image of Bentham with like a, a twirly mustache, kind of wacky races. You need a dog called Muttley as well. Oh, well, people, please stop just randomly telling chairs to be deconstructed. I'm walking through the bases like a fucking minefield. Yeah, that's oh, no, probably still doing stuff it. that I've done. <laughs> that was probably me. Oh, curse you! Et cetera, et cetera. <laughs> I'm annoying everyone, it's great. <laughs>